and welcome to the video on IBPS PO 2014 exam. I am Ravi, Ravi Handa from handakafunda.com and I have just started an online coaching course for the IBPS PO 2014 exam. So now what I am going to discuss in this particular video are some details about the exam and then some details about the course. The exam this year will be held in three slots. The first slot being 11th and 12th of October, the second one being 18th and 19th of October and the third one being 1st and 2nd of November. So these are the dates for the 2014 exam. The exam as you might already know like last year will once again be online. It will have 5 sections in all. The paper will be 120 minutes or 2 hours long. What is the marking pattern? Well, you get 1 mark if you for every correct answer and minus 0.25 for every incorrect answer. That means you can't guess because if your guess goes wrong, one fourth of the marks will be deducted. The paper all in all will have a total of 200 questions and the 200 questions will be distributed like this. Yes, this is already declared. There is no doubt, no speculation about this part. Reasoning will have 50 questions, English slightly lesser 40. Quantitative aptitude will have 50 questions. General awareness will have 40 questions and well out of these 40 questions there will be 30 questions on banking only. So keep that in mind only the other 10 questions will be dealing with other stuff but 30 out of 40 questions will be on banking awareness. As a matter of fact you can go to our website handagafunda.com and download a free pdf for banking awareness. And let's say if you are watching this video on handagafunda.com, just scroll down a little and you will get the link to free download the banking awareness PDF. There will be 20 questions on computer knowledge, but these are essentially very, very easy questions. Just by the idea uh, that you know the basics of computers, you will be able to clear the cutoff in computer knowledge. Another point to note is that let's say you score 80 in just reasoning and quantitative aptitude and 000 in the others. Is that okay if the cutoff is 80? No, you need to clear individual cutoffs in all sections. What you can't do is, let's say you are very good in reasoning and you are very good in quantitative aptitude that you just score in these two and you neglect the others. You can't do that. You have to clear cutoffs in individual sections. But then again, the cutoffs are on the lower side. Typically, the sectional cutoffs are in mostly in single digits and sometimes for quant it goes around 10 but never more than that. At least it wasn't last year. Now, just to talk a little bit more about our course, our course essentially is dominated by videos. For reasoning, we have more than 50 videos. For quantitative aptitude, also we have more than 50 videos. For English, we have 25 videos and a majority of them are concentrated on reading comprehension because a lot of people face lot of issues with reading comprehension. For general awareness in computer knowledge, as you might see, we don't really have any videos because that can't really be taught with videos. At least I can't do it. And hence, we have some documents and practice questions to cover the general awareness and the computer knowledge portion. Along with that, we have 10 full length mock tests. So if you think about it, that is as good as having 2000 questions and all these questions are solved in detail. So what I mean to say by that, uh, what I mean to say by that is that let's say if you give a question, you get the answer as incorrect. We will provide you a detailed solution as to how the answer was derived. So don't think of the, these tests as just something to evaluate yourself but think of them as a great learning tool with which you can improve your score. Another point that I like to add especially that these tests are based on the new pattern. We analyzed the 2013 paper and based upon that we have made fresh tests, new tests which are based on the 2013 pattern. Now what a lot of other coaching institutes and I am not saying all of them but quite a few of the coaching institutes, they are using old papers. They will still have questions on, let's say, for example, visual reasoning, which wasn't very relevant if you look at the 2013 paper. And that is the reason we have remodeled our papers on the new pattern. Along with that, you get a good set of analytics 
that analytics will tell you which areas you are strong in and which areas you are weak in. So if you are preparing, you probably need to spend a lot more time on the areas you are weak in. And to identify them, what should you do? Give mocks. Now, some people are able to analyze the mocks on their own. But based upon the technology and the huge amount of data we collect from a lot of students, we are able to do that analysis a lot better. Not we as humans, but the algorithms that we have do that a lot better. Not only that, you also get an all India percentile because the testing partners that we are using are providing these tests, not just to Handa Kafanda, but to many, many other coaching institutes. So you will not be compared with just the other students on Handa Kafanda, but you will be compared across many other coaching institutes who are using the same tests. Coming to some other frequently asked questions about the course. What is the price of the course? The price of the course is 999 rupees. We might be running some discount when. So please check for that as well. Does it cover the full syllabus? Yes, it does. That's the objective of the course. That once you take this course, you don't need anything else. Once you take the course, you will have 24 seven access to it and you can view it anytime as per your convenience. Also, all the videos and all the questions which are there, you can not watch them just once. You can watch them twice. You can watch them five times. As a matter of fact, you can repeat it an infinite number of times. And what if you don't like the course? Well, you can take a refund. All you will need to do is just click on a link and we will get your refund processed. The faculty of the course, well, I'm Ravi Ravi Handa and I'm making this video. My email ID is ravihanda at gmail.com. So let's say if you still have some questions about the course or about the exam, does not matter whether you are a member of the course or not, feel free to email me on ravihanda at gmail.com. If there is something that you want to discuss, my number is 9765142632. And I have been teaching online for the last one and a half years. If you think about it, I have been teaching for last eight years now and I have taught at IMS, I have taught at Time and various other coaching institutes. Around one and a half years ago, I started teaching online on my own website, which is handagafanda.com. And since then, I have taught more than 5,000 students. Now, please note, these are not 5,000 random people who have registered on the website or that many visitors to the site because a lot of people like to talk that way. These are 5,000 students who paid for some or the other course of mine. So these are not some inflated data based upon how many people are viewing the videos on YouTube, but these are actually 5,000 students who trusted us and paid us money to teach them. Prior to that, I did some portion of my education at IIT Kharagpur. Not something to boast about when it comes to IBPSPO exam, but it has provided me with a certain set of skills, which I hope to use and probably train you to score better in the IBPSPO 2014 exam. With this, I'd like to wrap up this video. Hope you learned something from it and probably will subscribe to our course. Thank you.